A ribbon cutting ceremony this afternoon marked the official opening of the new Sun Prairie West High School. Afterwards, students, their families and community members got to tour the building and its brand new facilities. And then next Monday, more than 1300 students will walk through Sun Prairie West doors for their first day of school. A $164 million referendum voted on three years ago allowed for a second comprehensive high school to be built with the original high school now named Sun Prairie East. We're excited for this community to finally be able to get in to see this new school. This is their school. Uh, they, they passed uh, uh, $164 million in increased taxes for them for children in the school district. And we could not be more grateful to the community for what they're providing to children in the school district. Some of the school's new features include a performing arts center, a pool, two, two gymnasiums, and learning communities that are referred to as DENS. Those DENS are equipped with new technology to help students collaborate with each other on a variety of subjects. I am excited for all of the collaboration areas because they have really fun chairs, but they also have whiteboard walls where a whole bunch of people can like gather. Like if you're in physics, but also taking calculus, you're able to like sort of combine those two classes and collaborate in that area work through problem sets that take uh, calculus principles and applying them with physics. Sun Prairie West wasn't the only school in the district opening with a ribbon cutting ceremony today. Earlier this morning, the new Central Heights Middle School and Prairie Phoenix Academy also celebrated its grand openings.